heard that stinking stingray, but. No, it's not full. I'm maybe a little guy, but. Probably a jack. Jack. Jackass. Jackass. Fucker. Just like snook all hanging out below yeah. it. Shark? <laughs> <laughs> Shark. Jump onto him. Just ride one out, dude. <laughs> Travel. This is like the blue heron of fishing right now. A little bit lower than that, BJ. Yes. I changed sexes, Cross. Oh, a little snook fish. <laughs> He's just got a little key. Uh, no. <laughs> here we go, here we go. I'm gonna, I'm gonna peer this fucker. <laughs> yeah! Nice fish, Cross. Nice fish. Is that through a tie ball? On my rod. Oh, no. Negative. Uh, it's close. Oh, wow, Shana. What? I did it again. Hey, why do you keep doing this? Go on. You got a good fish. Stand by. You're not. You're not reeling, but it makes that noise. So up back. Nice. There you go. Uh, perfect idea. I how to get this to come out. Oh yeah. <laughs> now we can see. Okay. So walk over this way. Walk over this way so that you don't get caught by any of the pilings. Blue heron. Blue <laughs> heron. We don't need a heron. Man. Really? <laughs> really? <laughs> Somebody said it, so it got stuck in my head. Oh my god, what are you doing? What is this, yeah. a photo op? Oh yeah. Oh, you're taking a video. And then now there's yeah. fucking Lil John going. Fucking <laughs> Lil John, dude, seriously. <laughs> Crosby picks like the worst music at like. <laughs> How's it the worst? It's music? the best music. Move, move. Flip in it. Go. You're fine. <laughs> the drag wants you. Oh, it sort of works. Yeah. You made a good splash. This one's getting hit or you got hooked with it. Come on up. That's close. That's better. Actually, that's about the same size. Alright, so I haven't finished the video yet that I'm planning on uploading, but I plan on naming it something along the lines of the last dock fishing video, which I figure I'd explain why it's called that, and hopes that people won't think I'm ending the Fishing with Jupe series, I guess it would be called, so I'm not ending it, I'm just, uh, I, I have moved, I've told a few people about that, and like my live streams and stuff, so if you didn't know about that, I have moved, so that's why it's going to be the last dock fishing video, but I plan on uh, a couple weeks I'm going to be going down to the Keys, I normally go around August, but uh, my friends moved it up to the to July, so in marathon I do that yearly trip. So that should be fine. I'm gonna, I plan on recording a lot of fishing stuff there. Hopefully we can catch some good fish. If not, then uh, there won't be much videos of it, many videos of it. Then if I do, there'll be a bunch of videos of it. So hopefully with that, and also since I moved now, uh, I live more up in the intercoastal and. It's probably going to take me like a half hour to get to where I lived before on the inlet, if you didn't know. I, I lived on Juber Inlet right there. And uh, yeah, it's going to be a little boat trip that I'm not used to, but that's what I'm sort of looking forward to. I figured I, 
I was thinking I should make a video trying to find my house uh, by boat because I have no idea. I've never been far back into the intercoastal where I'm at. So that's going to be an adventure. So if any of you are out there and you see me like stuck on a sandbar or something, just be like, hey man, that'll, that'll probably be me because what I'm from what I've talked to a few of my neighbors, they said the sandbars are out here. So I got to watch out for them. And uh, the other thing I was thinking, I was thinking about getting a kayak because there's supposed to be some good uh, canal, like intercoastal, like mangrove for like, I've been hearing tarpon, redfish, and snook and stuff. So I never really was much of an inshore guy. I kind of, the only inshore stuff I really did was off my dock for snook. I'm mainly offshore, but I plan on doing some more offshore fishing. I'm finally getting my boat fixed. Uh, I wanted to get it fixed and then started having to move and everything. And uh, that kind of got in the way. So I haven't been able to get out of my boat, but like I said, pretty soon I'll be going out of the Keys. Hopefully I'll have some fishing stuff. And I haven't been fishing at all besides uh, what I upload in this video. So that's all the fishing stuff I have. Sorry if you guys, I know a lot of you people I've been subscribing lately for fishing and I've mainly been doing gaming stuff, but that's pretty much because the gaming videos are pretty easy to make. I play like an hour and that's like four, video, four or five videos right there. But uh, fishing, I actually have to go out and lately I've been busy with moving, trying to get settled here in the new house and everything. So uh, yeah, hopefully uh, you guys enjoy the final dock fishing. It's not anything too intense. It's some snook and uh, some jack, but it was fun. You know, uh, a lot of people are like, how the hell can you live there? And I have uh, personal reasons that, I don't know, I don't really like talking about it. And, uh, I don't know, I guess we'll, uh, I guess we'll explain it out. Uh, I explained it in one video. I haven't really talked about it in any of my other videos. I tried keeping it, like, off my channel. But, uh, I mentioned it in a Minecraft video around Christmas. But, uh, last year my, uh, dad died. So, before then... Uh, my mom, dad, and I uh, talked about it and felt like the best thing for all of us would be moving, and that's to answer the question of why the hell would you move from uh, where you are, because that's the thing, and then everyone always asks that, and I always feel awkward having to explain it, but uh, that's pretty much why, and uh, felt like it was the best thing to do, and I guess shit happens, you know? That was like a pretty cool-ass spot having to live there not having, being able to live there thanks to my parents and uh, 25 years, that's pretty good. And however long, 30 something years, my parents there, that was a, that was a pretty amazing spot to live in right there and having the ocean and everything. And uh, I really appreciate it and I was glad I've, unfortunately I've been able to share, well, I said it backwards, but I mean, I'm glad I was able to share some of what I was able to experience. Cause I mean, I only made like, I think it's like 30 something videos for like the fishing stuff. And I so wish like I had the GoPro or like even like I'm using this regular camera to like like share like the cool stuff I was able to do and see like living right there on the inlet because that was like a really, really amazing place to be and be able to experience that. And I like being able to share that and like having my friends and stuff come over and then being able to show videos to you guys and that kind of stuff. So. Yeah, I guess stuff happens, and uh, I plan on continuing the fishing stuff, and of course all the gaming stuff, that's pretty, I like doing that, so, I don't know, I got the Keys trip coming up, so hopefully we can catch some fish for that, and then, uh, I would like to get a kayak and try and get out, and try and figure out some of the inshore fishing here, and then, still summertime, and hopefully my boat will be fixed when I get back from the Keys, and then we can continue on uh, doing some offshore stuff because that's what I really like doing. So, uh, yeah, hopefully you enjoy the last video for uh, dock fishing. It's not the last fishing video. I want to make sure about that, that everyone doesn't think I'm, like, done with it. So, uh, yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed, and uh, thank you for watching.